Hello students, my name is Sumit Mehta. Today in this lecture we will discuss about conversion of units. So I will tell you how to convert one unit into another unit. Okay. So in the exams there can be many questions in which you are given two units in a single question and you are asked to give the answer in one unit. Okay. So this will help you in these type of questions. So let me first say one centimeter is equals to ten mm. Okay, and one meter equal to hundred centimeter. So students, these conversion of units you have to learn from your heart, basically to do solve the question easily. Okay. and whenever you are given a unit 1 cm square means it is a rectangle or it is a square of side 1 1 one cm 1 cm so and you have to give the answer in mm so what you will do is 10 into 10 will be 100 mm square so 1 cm square is always equals to 100 mm square so now comes to 1 m square okay so this will be equals to 100 cm into 100 cm so this is 10000 cm square okay so 1 m square is equals to 10000 square and if i have to convert this cm square into mm square so what i will do is 10000 into again 100 mm square so this will be 10 raised to power 6 mm square So I am writing here again. One meter square is equals to ten raised to power four centimeter square is equals to ten raised to power six millimeter squares. Okay, students. And there is one more unit, one kilometer. So there are thousand meters in a kilometer. So if you are asked to solve one kilometer square, so you will say. Thousand into thousand meter square. This will be ten raised to power six meter square in a one kilometer square area. Okay, and one more thing, one hectare. This is also another unit to measure the length. So this is equals to hundred into hundred. So hectare will be given to you when you are solving a question of square like say this is the side of 100 and 100 and a field of one area one hectare so this is directly equals to 100 into 100 meter square this is 10 raised to power 4 meter square so students these conversion of units are very important from exam point of view okay and if you know this then you can easily convert one unit into another unit okay and these type of uh, conversion will help you to solve the questions easily when you are given two units and you have to find out the answer in one unit okay and if you have still any doubt how to convert one unit into another then please do comment in the comment section students and also download the app of scholars learning from the play store or app store student Thank you happy learning students